Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Infra. This is Chapter 6, Map 2, the Pit Heath Metro Station, which we'll get to here in a few minutes. There's a sewer grate with a manhole there. That'll cover. Let's just make sure where there's nothing useful down here. There's a photograph that we want, and there's this pipe here. Let's quick save before we go in here. That makes eight packs of flashlight batteries. Caution, hot surface, do not touch. Still six packs of batteries left. All right, let's quick save and... Mm. And let's not do that. So we can't go through that way, but we did discover this manhole cover that we moved. Want some milk, anyone? Finally, some fresh air. Of all the doors that you could lock, it just had to be this one. We can't get out. Shut off the burner. Seven packs of camera batteries now. All right, it says it's under maintenance and they've just got it decoupled from whatever that device is there, but they forgot to tag it out properly and disable it so it won't run. the lid back on so nobody manages to fall into the hole. And back through this pipe. How did I get out of here a minute ago? So now, through the magic of video games, this passage is suddenly not too hot to crawl across. Come on, flashlight, work with me here. And then we can drop into that room we were just in. for a key card. And this is a service to-do list. Investigate the cause of the interference on this radio-based key system and fix it. And toilets.
Intrigue. I don't know why that's an evidence of this conspiracy that's going on around us, but um, we shall. Okay, we have to go to plan B then. That one's no longer interfering. There we go. And that's the key card that was left laying around. The elevator is not interactive. Then again, I'd say Mark's had enough elevators for a while. Strike department, PR department, auditorium. Broken. Broken. Someone should get that fixed. What kind of building are we in if they have a strike department? Dear MWU, MWU board members, for your extraordinary work on defending the rights and interests of the blue-collar workers of Stahlberg, I'm gifting you this industrial-sized box of delicious sugar-free Haribo Evil Bear candy packs. This should be enough to last you the rest of the year. I hope you will have some sugar-free sweet moments and keep the good work. Metal Worker. Interesting. That's obviously not Haribo, a common manufacturer of gummy bears. Fascinating. Strikes for the autumn. Strike of the PTWU, Public Transport Workers Union at the same time as the met municipal elections no metro public transport available in the city prevents people from reaching the polling stations union members have access to polling stations and choose favorable politicians that's not nice Mikhail Rosenthal Stahlberg Steel so he's the guy that um, Alex Hartman apparently had offed and um, the guy who um, built that steel mill that we were stuck in in chapter 4. Alright, and it seems that those little cheap radio receivers that we keep finding everywhere interfere with their, um, access control system. I think dead fish in your pond is not a good sign. Huh, I don't even have to point at the, um... keycard reader. It just automatically opens when I walk near it, which is handy. Turn off that blinking box, which looks like a modem. Lagtel brand modem. Only for authorized persons, so why do you leave it laying around? to go outside and retune that box. Mm. 
Okay, that one doesn't like me. That one doesn't like me. Stahlberg Steel, our part, Walter, former workers, our members, union fees paid. Contact press, must clean up reputations. Note, check the archives for more information, shelf S3. Alright, shelf S3 might be important. Article where the workers blame us for the collapse, unnecessary apostrophe. That music was surprisingly diegetic. Now the store works. Right. There's something else we're supposed to find in here? Keys or something? Now we have the um, archives key that we found on that keyboard in there. I think we're going to go to the next step up. Next floor. Of course, there's nothing. Now we can get in here. That makes eight pipes of camera batteries. This is S3. Fascinating. Stahlberg Steel collapsed. Collapsed. Stahlberg Steel LLC has collapsed yesterday. Yesterday evening, without earlier profit warning or other notice, the company, which has been the, fl the Capital Region flag carrier for decades, filed for bankruptcy. After huge strikes orchestrated by the Metal Workers Union, MWU stated started the strikes on Monday morning after two weeks of fruitless negotiations. Stahlberg City Council had an emergency meeting late yesterday evening where they discussed how the Capital Region will survive this loss of tax income with already high unemployment numbers. Another meeting is scheduled to start today at 11 a.m. The situation isn't as bad as it seems, and I assure you we can manage to work this out, says Stahlberg Mayor Adolf Altmeyer. Okay, city announces budget cuts because of the bankruptcy. President of Egypt, um, Stahlberg Football Club, or Football Club wins Football League. In Stahlberg Olympic Stadium. Hmm, interesting. The most the other important article in here is that the Metal Workers Union is being blamed. Stahlberg Steel hasn't given any official statement about the closure, but employers' federations already blame Metal Workers Union for the bankruptcy. Metal Workers Union had no real sense of direction with their demands. They had already caused a multitude of problems with their constant harassing, so it was just a matter of time when something really bad happened, said employer spokesperson Georg Ilves on a TV One interview yesterday evening. Metal Workers Union said they won't com comment on the matter until the bankruptcy has either been cancelled or probated. All right.
The Metal Workers Union, Stahlberg Steel, Operation Will of Steel. All right, comrades. 1310-1981, that is October 13th, 1981. Mark that date up because that will be the day when we strike at Stahlberg Steel and we will strike hard. On that date, the corrupt ownership of the Stahlberg Steel will fall into our hands. The workers are fed up and willing to strike. Our men and women in the facility are ready and waiting for our command. On the 13th day, the majority of the factory's management are away in an important corporate meeting at SBS headquarters, and the whole factory is entirely staffed by our members and common workers. The plan, just before lunch hour, when the workers are hungry, one of our activists will announce that due to recent layoffs and cuts, we can't serve lunch today. Instantly after that, our activists will go on strike, chanting slogans that will encourage the workers to join the strike. The hunger and cumulative anger towards the owners and the worsened working conditions will cause even the most devoted of Walter, the Walter Loyalist, Walter Loyalist to join the class struggle. This strike will allow us to tighten our grip on the giant money-making factory and possibly even shift its ownership to us. And I think one picture counts for both of these documents. Okay. Um, that had some distinctively communist phraseology in it. Interesting. Hey, Metal Man, Metal Men, we sent you a gift. Best regards, BWU. We're the strongest union in the city. Black trash bags, firewood. Not sure why you put firewood in a cabin like this. Batteries. Packs of flashlight batteries. Good, we're probably going to need them given the way Marseille is going so far. Now we've seen everything there is to see here in the archives. We don't want to go back out through that machine room because it was kind of a dead end. Um, we can't get into the subway. And we can get into the subway. But I don't think that's the way we want to go yet. Is there something upstairs that we want to do first? There's supposed to be some damaged cement here, so let me go back and find that. Is it in this tunnel? Excuse me a moment. There we go. Broken, damaged cement in the machine room. I think I'm going to need new camera batteries here in a moment. I think this whole side trip is just to get to that picture.
ladies room broken It's a pay toilet. Wait, what was my pin number? Ah, uh, one. Three, three, hmm, seven. Yeah, that was it. Okay, then we need to withdraw some money. Yes, there's a specific reason I'm doing this. We won't know until much later, but there is a reason we're doing that. Metro station. That shortcut you sent me on was a fucking death trap, but I made it here in one piece. Just one problem. The station's closed, and I think I'm locked inside. There's some kind of an angry mob outside. Oh shoot, I forgot about the protest. Uh, could you hang on a second? I might have some strings that I can pull. Yeah. A geocache. Of course, the geocache is why I came up here in the first place. Ouch. There we go. A jockstrap has pierced to wiggle, press canister to return to ragamuffin, or press blowfish hubcap window to trot your pickle. If you do this, you will lose any luscious corns in a significant pickaxes. There are B95EC1 pancreas. All right. Mark, you still there? Yeah. I called someone who works at the Metro, and there should be a maintenance tram somewhere around there. He unlocked the door for you. Take the tram and get back to the office. We need your help in here. I'll be there soon. Yeah. A cocktail has punished to kick. Press asymptote to return to base, or press glass, fern, lime to lay your asymptote. If you do this, you will lose any... Hard giblets in emaciated kilts. Error B1, 2D17, Butler. Hmm, that was not working. A lawnmower has sharpened. To vomit, press Tanner to return to golfer. Or press space, broomstick, bowl to smack your wallet. If you do this, you will lose any menacing rumpuses in board pancreases. Error 221516 Manure. Press any key to continue.
Wait, what was my pin number? Hmm, one, nine, yeah, that was it. All right, so that buying a ticket there gets you an achievement called Better Safe Than Sorry. And more of these things, you can fast forward these if you don't like them. A bachelor has probed to unzip, press cell to return to fireman, or press carpenter cat unibrow to withdraw your wrinkle. If you do this, you will lose any advantageous baboon in active maple trees. Air CA-912 giblet. Sword, a grape has cooked to pinch, press lion to return to plunger, or press jowl, wheelbarrow, nurse to forecast your goatee. If you do this, you will lose any possible arrows and naughty banjos. Here are 5-1-D-8-1-C, firecracker. Broom, an archaeologist has imploded to ride, press boot to return to chin, or press piano, bachelor, crack pipe to flatten your bench. If you do this, you will lose any pharmaceutical purses in noisy Tyrannosaurus Rexes. There is 00BCF0, loincloth. I think they've got a really bad version of Windows. Towel. A tooth has stood to implode, press balloon to return to chin, or press owl or oval armor or uvula to hack your purse. If you do this, you will lose any tangy mirrors in odd avocados. Air 5436FF towel. All right, well, the outside are getting quite annoying. But they left this door here open. I don't think there's anything... Everything seems to be in order. Seven packs of batteries left. I don't know why we need a picture here. Oh, there's a document on the table. And this is one I think we've seen before. Basically, this one talks about a Metro Workers protest today and a Walter Square Metro accident anniversary. Um... I think we probably have seen that report somewhere, I don't remember, but, um, if not, we can, we can read it on the video later. I'm gonna get away from those idiots outside, because they are too noisy. Radioactive hamburger, the stall burger. Was I supposed to get a picture of an elevator at the Union Building? Let's go back there if we can and just check. Yes, it says out of order. That's what we're taking a picture of. All right. And there's just one more picture left in this episode, or this level. And I think it's down this way that I want to go. Makes ten packs of batteries for the flashlight. All right. And this place actually looks fairly clean and um, not all that torn up compared to some of the places we've been. But there's somebody been living here.
still looks a million times better than most of the rest of the concrete we've seen in the game. And there's a train. Nuclear power plant production about to double. We saw that newspaper back at the office. Right. And the other thing we need to do here is we've got a red light, a red signal showing us here. So what we need to do is kick this to manual mode and set it to auxiliary track and that will also should also do the switch and that gets us to a green light nice ride and this is kind of like the raft ride where it continues into the next level so we will end the video here because we've already been in two levels in this recording. So we'll end this video here. And let me figure out which save slot I want to write over. Um, four, two, one. I was going to use this three. So I think slot one is the one I want to use, which is all the way back in the steel mill. And then we will end this video here. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time and we will take a train ride. Hopefully get back to the office. Thanks for watching.